Excerpt from Arden's Journal I thought I was over this long ago. Maybe something about camping out with the ghosts of the Great War behind me might have pushed my thinking back to my college days. Maybe it's the Thalmor. Every time I see someone in that uniform I have to look twice to make sure it's not him. The face I used to look at was such admiration. Now I can't help but picture and feel a twist of agony in my gut. I wonder where he is now. I wonder if he's learned anything. That day in Kavach is still as fresh to me as though it happened last week. I still remember the symbol on the green wax seal. I still remember the way his eyes deadened and his shoulders slumped as he read the letter. Conscription notice. The Almari Dominion was withdrawing his permit to work in Cyrodiil. We said our goodbyes that day. I knew as well as he did what the Thalmor did to people who refused them. He told me he would never be the same once they got their talons in him. I didn't quite believe him, even as he made his way, alone, to Anvil where the Justicia was waiting. He couldn't be seen in the company of one such as myself. When I saw him again, he was one of them through and through. A Thalmor mage, robed in black with eyes as dead as the day he got that letter. He wouldn't even speak to me, just looked down that long nose like I was a filthy mongrel. I know he recognized me. To this day I can't help but feel betrayed. He had no choice, but still, he could have spoken to me at least. Sent me letters addressed to a colleague. Something. No, I thought I was over this, but I still hate him. And every time I look at one of them, I'm reminded of that. Gods damn him, and gods damn the Thalmor that broke him. Uh, is that- what is that? Is that a statue or is that a person? Or an ogre or something? That is in fact a statue. What an interesting spot, actually. Um, the Sentinel. Right. I wonder who that's supposed to be. Ah, uh, and I wonder which road I'm supposed to be taking. I'm assuming uh, that way somewhere. Oh, and there's the road all the way down there. Well done. Again! Again well done. Whew. I need to get my brain back on straight. I think. <laughs> Oi. Alright. Oh. Yep. Careful. You've got to be careful with those kind of drops. You have to like roll in order to, you know, spread out the um, the shock on your joints. I don't remember where I learned that from. I don't think it was my college days. <laughs> Might have been. Someone, someone I uh, I used to ram around ruins and whatnot with, maybe. Ooh, I need to... I need to stop thinking about that. Really. I need to keep my eyes and ears alert. Just in case. Right, okay, so that path leads down probably back to Bruma. Which means this is actually a path through here. Right, Mountain Watch. Bruma. Um, all right, well, we're gonna go this way. I have a feeling that this is where I'm supposed to be going. I guess we'll find out when I either hit the border or something. We'll see. Gotta be alert. There's wolves out here. There's bears. There's deer. <laughs> I heard something. There we go. Like I said, wolves. Really? Really? I really shouldn't be using this sword for wolves, actually. Um, anyone else? There's one more. Oh. Sorry, Rathlon. It was what I had on hand. Right. I need to switch that out real quick. There. 
Alright. Moving on. You know, this rusty old Alessian sword doesn't really hold a candle to that other one. Glenroy. Alright. Who was Glenroy? That's what I want to know. Um... Hmm. You know, had I half a mind, I probably would have... I wonder what's up there. It looks like it could possibly be bandits. Or something. I guess we'll find out. Um, let's see, let's see. What is in here? It looks like... Um... Yeah, that's what I suspected. That is an ogre cave indeed. I think I should probably back away slowly. Don't mind me. Don't mind me. I'm just kind of too curious for my own good. Right, let's go. Let's go. I would rather not tangle with ogres today, thanks. Not today. Oof. Cold air, not nice. Not nice. Not used to running in cold air in high altitude. Whew. Right. Oh, hello. Is that mountain watch right there? Right, is is this an inn? What is this? Hello? Oh, um, alright, it's fine. Um, sorry. Uh, I didn't realize this was protected. I'm just gonna be on my way. Right. I wonder what that was. Whew. All right. All right. Let's see. Don't think there's anything over here. Obviously. Hello. Look. I'm not in the mood. I'm not giving you anything. Right, you'll try. You will try, I'll give you that. But, um... Yeah. Don't fight a mage with a mace. Yikes. Oh, look at that, she's got chainmail armor. I don't think it would fit me as it is. But I might be able to tweak it a little. I have a chance. I guess I'll give it a shot if I ever find somewhere to sit down for the evening or whatever. Set up camp for the night and see if I can rearrange it a little bit. Take the gauze out of the sides or whatever. Oh, it's going to be a long road. I can feel it in my knees. Oh look, there's a lake. That's not a lake, that's um... Oh. I hear wolves. That looks like it could be Frozen Grotto. Ah, there they are. Up there. I'm gonna have to be careful getting down here. Oh, alright. Um... Right. Let's see what's up in here, shall we? Hopefully not more... Ah, no, no, no. We'll just put that there. Let's see. Nope. 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 Ah, uh, that's a lot of spiders. Oh, no, 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 you don't see anything. I'm going to leave you alone. Goodbye, spiders. Ugh. Hello. <sighs> really? Sorry. It bit me as I was trying to cast that rune. 
That's the one downside to using runes and not, you know, flames. Just regular old flames. But fl just regular destruction magic lacks finesse, I think. Besides, learning runes has helped me understand many an ancient language. Actually. Oh, I hear something. Is that the wolf? Yep. Ooh. Well, like I said, fire runes are superior to regular flames. Sorry, dude. <laughs> well, that was, um, that was interesting. Oh, we took out the fox. That's a shame. Oh well, circle of life and all that. I've whis- I'm whistling my S's. Whoops. It's the cold, I tell you. It's the cold. It's the cold and the altitude. Altitude is a real thing, my friends. It really is. Alright, let's see what's up here besides some cans. Oh. Wow. Yeah, that's, um, that's beautiful. Whew, all right. Hello, rabbit. It's getting thin up here, isn't it? <laughs> oh, more wolves. Oh, hello. What's that? All right. I'm going to put this right here. Yeah, that's what I thought. Um, well there's an unlucky fellow if I ever saw one. Oh, it must have been a Khajiit. Well, he doesn't need any of this anymore. Copper and sapphire circlet. Um, hmm. I don't know about this book, actually. I'm going to leave it there, just in case anybody else needs a circlet. I certainly don't need anything metal on my head right now, because it's freezing. My arms do not appreciate this armor right now. That is a long drop. That is a very long drop, and there's a wolf. Yeah, I don't know what else I expected, besides so maybe a bear. That was interesting. Uh, right. Up all the switchbacks. Oh, hello. I have what important up here? business to attend to. Please don't tarry. Right, obviously. Um, sorry to whatever. Sorry. Sorry to whatever. Nice job, Arden. All right. This looks like an ambush spot if I ever saw one. I don't hear anything. So that's good. Gotta listen. There's a fallen tree up there. I wonder if that if that's a path up to the spire. Because I don't know how to get up there from here. Uh, all right, let's uh, let's try it. Let's try it. Um, right, it's very slippery. All right. Oh, oh, we've we've got it. We've got it. Right. All right. Oh look, there's an ore vein up here. Okay. If I can get up on this without losing my footing, I'm losing my footing. All right, back to the ground. Oh, okay. <laughs> Maybe not. Maybe not. Okay. Whew, alright. Um. Oh, there's a camp down there. Like, all the way down there. Let's go, uh. Let's go see what they're about, shall we? I will find a way up to that spire, mark my words. I don't know when, I don't know how, but I will find a way. Leave it to Arden. Persistence is my middle name. Well, 
actually it's Percy. It's it's Perseus. So, you know, pretty close, I think. Oh great. Alright. You wanna play it this way? We can play it this way. Just warning you. You might Yeah. You didn't heed my warning. Oh great, there are Imperial Guard. What is this? Not are they Are they impersonators or are they actually Nope, they're impersonators. Alright, come here. Damn you. I'm sorry, I just stuck my sword in your throat. How are you speaking, sir? Oh well. I'll take your gold. I will take your brandy. I do like a bit of brandy. They're all wearing... Okay, most of them are wearing Imperial armor. So that's, um... Interesting. Right. Okay. Well, they've got a camp down here. Let's search this place, shall we? Might clean them out a little. Um, tanning rack. Nice. Nice. Uh, I think the chest that I could use? Ooh, look at that. A dwarven mace. This looks to be recently forged and not the genuine artifact. Heh, <laughs> artifact. Anyway, I will take the soul gems and the gold. I might as well take that mace as well. Alright, uh, this looks like as good a spot as any. No wood block. That's alright. Looks like as good a spot as any to have a seat and uh, see if I can work on that chainmail. I will admit, it is very nice having a warm fire. I really have to get rid of those clothes. I really do. Alright, let's see what I can do with this. Alright, I have to um, unlink a couple chains here. I have to re sew this bit. Uh, I might just be able to. Right, I can just tear this seam out, that's fine. It's nice to have a dagger on hand, although a lockpick works pretty well for ripping out seams, I'll be honest. And then the rest of this should fit over what I've got already. Um. Oh, it's lined, that's nice. Hmm. Right, and these little metal plates, that should be alright to keep on, and uh, obviously the belt will have to be switched out because that one is far too small for me. Actually, it's, um, it, it fits. Uh, whoops. I, I, um, uh, I'm a bit smaller than I thought I was. Oh well. I, uh, I guess I'm not short in comparison to high elves, I'm just short. 